because you're a former athlete, and that's why I bring it up. For those of you who don't know, Carmen ran the 800 meters uh, for what university? University of Vermont. And she is in their Hall of Fame. That's incredible. And for what? For a record you set? Um, I think I set a few. So like overall? <laughs> oh, wow. I think most of them have been beaten except for some of them. I don't know. I don't really remember which ones. So you don't remember any of your big milestones, period. Do you spend <laughs> a lot of weeks? I can tell you my best 800 <laughs> time. That's about it. What was it? 208.03. In what year, if you don't mind me asking? I think sophomore year, actually. Okay. And I was like, oh, great. I'll make Is that the Olympics still fast? pretty soon. Yeah, it's uh, it's not, it's not as fast as I wanted it to be though. Yeah, but you it went. To, you're trying to go to the Olympics. That was the next move for you, and you. Just um, I'm sure I had Olympic dreams. <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> best job I ever had was coaching. Keep going. Oh. Uh, was coaching high school track and field. Cross oh, that's country. cool. Cross country, isn't it? Yeah, it was so fun. They're so funny. Kids are so fucking funny at that age. And you just you're just like go for a run, and they're like no, and you're like <laughs> okay, I don't know. What did you want to say? Ed? So, because I, I have a track about, story. I was asking about 800 meters. Is 800 mm-hmm. meters um, like 50 meter dash is very short? So 800 meters that doesn't exist anymore. Oh, it doesn't. <laughs> no, it's a hundred meter. meter dash. Hundred meter dash. <laughs> Not since yeah. maybe like the Greek. Yeah, yeah, maybe. <laughs> or like third grade. <laughs> maybe back in your <laughs> scumbag <laughs> silly. <laughs> The mile run the where it's like around Philly the Olympics. building. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. You're like, who measured this? You're running like a two minute mile. You're like, I guess I'm the fastest kid in the world. I love that you have to like push kindergartners out of the way to get through the. I love. Uh, that. It's, so now it's two laps, but two laps, meters, big, two laps two around full like laps. a quarter mile track. Is that what? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. So, so four laps would have been a mile. That, so there you go. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I don't yeah. know the difference between meters and miles. That's why I get confused. Yeah, it's tough. Yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. Uh, but okay. anyway, so track. You coached high school track. I ran track in high school. I am going to suggest to my son if he likes sports to definitely run track. Mm-hmm. The most beautiful women. I was just about to say the co-ed factor was oh, really what it, drew me in. It really did because <laughs> everyone was in incredible shape, mm-hmm. and you're wearing oh, the skimpiest of skimpy stuff. Mm-hmm. Like especially women that do the uh, javelin, or like uh, pretty much all of it. Like yeah, nowadays, it. especially it used to be like those sh- dolphin kind of shorts with the built-in underwear. That would be like the track yeah. stuff. Ugh, now women wear absolute like spandex. Yeah, bathing suits. Oh, yeah. oh, like the volleyball. Especially women that run uh, the 800. Yeah. Yep. They wear almost nothing. Mm-hmm. And they're, the muscle definition, there's so much more of it because it's a torque speed, Ed. I think school you. Uh, the <laughs> marathon gets more thin and lean. Okay. But the fat, the sprinters, they get like yeah. the bubble butt and oh. the great legs. Yeah. Like Jackie Joyner Kersey, mm-hmm. Flo Jo. And we're talking like shelf butts oh okay mm-hmm. uh which is my thing Ed. yeah and, you know i felt right at home <laughs> i would you literally lay in the grass before your i because i remember being very much uh my sex drive being very high as a, as a young man like 17 and being in that you're laying in the grass and you're watching these beautiful women stretch and sprint like it is really hard to keep your mind anywhere else but like That's i'm wild never gonna get a girl that looks like that it was so awesome and depressing all in the same moment that's so cool because i played i went to an all boys high school and all my sports there was never like the the, like sex was so separate from sports like you would never get like horny (laughs) dude at a a practice track was insane that's wild yeah that's like why i ran track i also had the same similar yeah like just a huge sex drive (laughs) it was just (laughs) You know, didn't know what it was either. You're just like sitting there, just pent up. Everyone's yeah, running around in their little outfits. Ugh. Yeah. Did you date a lot on the teams? Oh yeah. Really? Oh yeah. Yeah, Isn't we shared that... buses and we would just be there like glaring at oh, each other. Oh yeah, because other. boys and girls shared the bus. Everybody's yep. together. Yes. Oh, yeah. yeah. Other teams had more money and bigger teams, so they'd be separate on the buses. I think I like made sure that I went to a college where it was just like everyone's on the same bus. <laughs> We're staying in the same hotel rooms. You'd get your roommate to switch with you, and you just go. Oh man, yeah. that's, you're like applying for colleges. Like, what's the transportation situation? <laughs> you know, like a <laughs> bus, sweaty and half naked, because that's what I'm looking for. Oh, people for. get jobs after they go to Harvard. Okay. <laughs> yeah, I passed up going to SC because you know the bus rides are better in Vermont. <laughs> they separated the boys and the girls. Can't have that. <laughs> you gotta let mama eat. <laughs> <laughs>